These are my weights. For those of you who are getting on in age or maybe the very young, this is a fairly good exercise to do and one that you could do every morning. So, three pound weights, you might have two, it's all arbitrary, doing 100 repetitions or uh, 30 repetitions. Uh, uh, two sets, one set, three sets, it's all arbitrary. Uh, with arthritis and my age, this is something that I could do every day. So, without further ado, loosening up, twisting behind you, and reaching for the furthermost point smoothly, fluidly. Looking back to a most rear point, twisting back fluidly, not hard. Another exercise. I'm going to try to fly. My goodness. I'm going to roll my hands upward, roll my hands inward. I'm going to do 30 of these. I'm going to roll my head backwards, downward, thirty of those. I'm going to take my weights, put them between these two fingers. One, two. I'm going to do 30 of those. I'm going to lower my head. When I go up, I'm going to go back. And sometimes I try to go back about as far as I can. I have neck trouble. I want to stay fluid. My back, I want to stay fluid, and so on. Another thing that I'll do, very simple. And I'll do a hundred of these just because it's so easy. One. And I'm kind of twisting my neck at the same time. Neck problems. I'm going to stay fluid. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. And I'm pushing my head down. Trying to... Remember to do these things, you gotta focus. Sometimes I'm doing these things where I'm watching television, something like that, and, and I'll get focused on the action on a, a video or something like that, and I won't be focusing on what I'm doing. Maybe turn the music on instead. Regardless, another thing that I'll do is I want to punch. Not really a hard punch, I want the fluid movement. Hold the waist to my chest. One, two, I'm going to reach out as I can. Three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to do a hundred of those. It's not too bad. 51 arm, 50 with the other. Something else that I'm going to do is to try to do a standing sit up. Lying down and doing sit-ups does not agree with you any more injuries. So I'm going to bend down, raise up, bend down. I'm going to hold the waist to my chest, a little extra weight there. Now something I've added to this, I'm going to go down, back up, and then I'm going to raise it. I do uh, add di different things, just like the rolling of the uh, hand when I'm doing some things. Try to get some more movement in there. 
Now sometimes I'll, I'll, I may tend to want to lift the foot, and sometimes I'll uh, try to go against that impulse because I want the, the movement to occur in the body and not in my feet. But regardless, and I'm moving my head up and down, and I'll do about a hundred of these. This is the most boring one, so I'll try, sometimes I'll put this ahead of another one or two just to get it out of the way because I don't like it. So have fun with it and do what you feel like. Some exercises that I don't do anymore. Uh, one of them for younger people might be okay today, uh, but as I get older, I, I don't like to do this one anymore. This is called the rocking chair. You reach down. rock down. I've been able to do a lot of these in the past, but any more of my knees don't care too much for me. Another exercise that's an old reliable, of course, what is it? Is it the windmill or touch your toes? That's a great exercise. It's been a great exercise in the past. I don't need to stress the knee joint, the hamstring, or the uh, uh, tendons back here. I don't need to do that anymore. I don't care for it. There's a lot of things to do, and you might just research and add what you can. As you grow older, your body changes, and so, I try to do what I can with a limited amount of time. And now one of the first things that I do each morning is that I ride my indoor uh, bicycle machine and I call it El Diablo because it's not near as much fun as riding a bicycle outdoors generally or as you can imagine. But I ride my bike inside for about an hour. There are uh, uh, machines at the uh, weight rooms and so on where you press. A lot of people like this kind of thing. The older you get, there isn't anything more fluid than riding a bicycle. Now there are cars and animals and stuff to contend with on the road, drivers and so on and so uh, But I will say that an indoor exercise bicycle type machine is more fluid for you. It's not going to stress your joints. And in a lot of cases and maybe most cases with injuries, ski injuries, uh, uh, breaking legs or uh, leg injuries, things like that, Doctors will often recommend riding a bicycle when they wouldn't recommend the pushing. Now you can push on a bicycle as well, but generally you're talking about smooth movement. So, these are things I recommend. Have a good time. Don't do anything you don't feel good about. And happy trails.